Hey guys, welcome to Entertainment Talk Nation. Uh, just want to give you guys a quick uh, channel update. There's been a lot going on this week. Uh, I'm trying to play catch up with a lot of things. Um, first thing is uh, tomorrow night at 9 p.m., Friday night at 9 p.m., I'm going to be joining Damien Bravo over at G Universe for a live stream. We are going to be discussing basically uh, a year review on everything kaiju related. Um, obviously, the, the bulk of that conversation will be Godzilla, but I'm sure we'll get to some Pacific Rim uh, and other topics as well. Um, Saturday night at 10 p.m., I will be joining Jacob Hill on his channel to do a live stream with him. And uh, we're obviously going to be talking some more Godzilla. So uh, those are two live stream events coming up in the next two days. And next Friday, uh, you'll definitely expect to see my Godzilla trailer review pending that it comes out before The Hobbit. Uh, unless, of course, it comes out sooner than that. Um, I will be going to see the movie Friday evening. I was going to go. I was going to go see the first showing that day. Uh, but my wife wants to see the movie and I don't want to, uh, you know, um, I don't want to take that away from her. So, uh, my review will probably be uploaded late that night. Uh, I know it's a, it's the movies looks like it's a little bit over a two hour run and, uh, expecting to see a lot of trailers before that movie. So if the Hobbit's two hours and 15 minutes, when you take into account commercials, trailers, and all the other crap, they show before a movie, uh, probably be out of there in about two hours and 45 minutes. Um, there still is a slight chance I might just go see the movie early anyway and then go see it again with my wife. I don't mind the token films. Uh, I I watch the Lord of the Rings trilogy pretty regularly, every couple of months I would say. So it won't be out of the, it wouldn't be out of the ordinary for me to go see The Hobbit twice. Uh, a little out of the ordinary to see it twice in one day, but. If there's a Godzilla trailer in front of it, that's not going to bother me. So, <laughs> um, also, uh, as you see, there's been a lot of videos being uploaded. I actually pre-recorded a lot of these videos. Um, tomorrow, Friday, along with the uh, live stream at night. You can also expect to see my PS4 review. I've had the system for three weeks now. Uh, I already filmed the review a couple of days ago, but I'm just going to air it. Uh, tomorrow or upload it tomorrow because tomorrow would be officially three weeks since I've had the machine uh, or maybe a month let me see eh, uh, three weeks next Friday would make a month because uh, I did get the system on launch for those of you who are familiar with my former channel I did an unboxing of the PS4 uh, on the release date so now I'm reviewing it to tell you guys what I have uh, experienced and what I you know more or less how I feel about the system. So, um, in between all that, the live streams, uh, I will be doing a live stream also for the Godzilla trailer on top of a regular review so we can all discuss it together. We can ask questions. Uh, we can also discuss and speculate. It's my favorite topic is speculating. Um, and between all that, we're going to do we're gonna do a lot of Walking Dead next week um, because I, I've been giving myself basically a week to soak in the last uh, episode and uh, there's a lot of things I want to talk about and speculate so we'll see a lot of Walking Dead uh, we're gonna get back into the video games and uh, conspiracy theories conspiracy theory series I'm gonna restart um, I'm gonna rehash every video I've done I'm just gonna obviously do it's gonna be different but it's gonna be the same topic so I'm gonna start off with the aliens and the UFOs and then go from there. Uh, the video games, uh, obviously I'm going to start off tomorrow with the PS4. <clears throat> and then we go forward from there. And finally, I'm going to have a brand new series on this channel. It's not going to be very often, but every time I get an opportunity, I'm going to do it. But what we're going to do is I'm going to have a how-to playlist. And the first video is going to be how to build a computer. Uh, for those of you who, again, have been familiar with my older channel and have been there from the early days... Uh, I do build computer. I have a very small business I conduct in terms of building computers and providing services. I also do uh, some IT work, more so working for a company. But uh, on the side, I do a lot of computer work. I have a pretty good stream of customers, and I've gotten actually a lot of orders <laughs> lately to build a bunch of machines. So I figured, why not take an opportunity? And uh, it's nothing original, of course. Millions of people have done these kinds of videos. But that doesn't mean I shouldn't do it. I also am very interested to 
uh, share with people my knowledge on computer building, uh, especially when it's in terms of gaming rigs. It also it always kind of pisses me off and goes on my ass sideways when I hear people spending eighteen hundred to two thousand dollars on a gaming machine when um, my machine can play any game out there in the world right now uh, on high quality and I didn't even crack a thousand dollars. So you're going to see a how-to video on a regular computer build, and then I'm going to do a un unveiling, I'm not going to call it unboxing, unveiling slash how-to uh, on building a gaming PC. What I'm going to do is probably hook up my camera to my wife's laptop and gut my computer and show you guys the inside and show you how I saved so much money on a gaming machine. Um, to and and you know and also just tell you guys what I do and and if you guys are ever interested in a gaming machine you can order one from me I take credit cards all that good stuff but we'll get into that detail uh, like I said later on next week when I when I start putting these machines together so um, so that's it just to recap and finally um, I want to thank everyone and I mean everyone uh, right as this video's um, going up. I have nearly 200 subscribers already. I would say about 80% of you uh, came back from my old channel. And I have a good portion of new subscribers as well. Um, and, you know, if, if, I, if 200 of my 1,100 subscribers have already come back in two days, I feel fairly confident that um, pretty much mostly everybody will return to me within the month. And that's an excellent feeling. That just goes to show me how... Uh, how you guys really enjoy my content and uh you know i try to make it as interesting as possible i try to make it as professional as possible and i try to give you guys the best latest news uh from the best sources possible but i am in no way shape or form a journalist i am just a commentator a reviewer uh that's very opinionated very honest um sometimes honest to a fault i have made some videos that have upset people in the past uh not that anyone else it's nothing i would publicize but you know, just a couple of emails, people expressing their disappointment, and that's fine. I don't, I don't expect everybody to agree with me. In fact, that's the beauty of doing this kinds of things is that nobody agrees. Uh, we all have different opinions, and I love hearing your guys' opinions. I love when I look at the comments and you guys express your thoughts or feelings. Uh, I've even had a couple of viewers really kind of hit me hard, but yet they still subscribe, and, and that's what I like. I, that doesn't bother me because uh, that you guys are entitled to that. It's a free country, but. With that said, I just want to thank you guys for your support. I want to thank you guys for really blowing up this channel. Um, as it stands now, I've made four Godzilla videos. Two of them are in the first uh, five pages of the rankings. So I have, you know, it was it was a little heartbreaking the other day when I looked at the pages. And I used to have four or five Godzilla videos in the first page. Now it's kind of like i got to fight my way back. But it looks like I will resurface in those rankings a lot sooner than than I did when I first started this. So, But it's been great. It has been a busy week. I've been doing a lot of videos, uh, trying to get you guys as much content as possible. And also talking about some topics that I really didn't get into last time because of all the problems I was having. But now that uh, things seem to be back to normal and I have all my freedom back, um, I can actually now have fun and do a lot of videos. So like I said, live stream tomorrow at 9 p.m. at Damian Bravo's channel. That's Universe G. Um, I know a lot of you have subscribed to him already, so if you look under my subscribers or subscriptions, you'll see him there. Universe G, a.k.a. Damian Bravo. He's got a great series going on right now where he's doing like five-minute videos of Godzilla documentary, and they're actually very, very good. So go check those out. And um, Jacob Hill, who is not a big-time YouTuber, but he's he's wanted to do a live stream with me for a while, and... Uh, you know, I'm not the kind of person that even f remotely thinks I'm anything like a celebrity. I will do a live stream with anybody. Um, obviously, I need to make time to do it, but I have a lot of fun um, hanging out with a lot of guys. And some of my subscribers who know me pretty well in terms of me just kind of uh, letting myself loose on other people's live streams and kind of uh, cracking jokes and troll bombing people. I'm kind of notorious for that, so, uh, and I actually am considering doing a segment called Subscriber Troll Bombing, where uh, once, a one, once a month or once a week, I'll pick a random subscriber, go to their channel, pick out a video that I think is pretty funny or goofy, and uh, kind of just uh, announce it to the world, so, <laughs> but I'm going to wait till I get much, much more subscribers for that, and then start troll bombing my subscribers, so. 
If there's any videos out there on your channel you don't want anyone to see, and just letting you know now, I'm giving you fair warning. Um, so that's about it. Like I said, there's going to be a lot of videos coming up in the coming weeks. I have a lot that are pre-recorded already. I have a lot that I'm still recording. Uh, there's two live streams in the next two days. And, um, obviously next week's going to be a very busy week with the Godzilla trailer. And, you know, this seems like everybody's out there wanting up, one upping each other. You know, you got, uh, Warner Brothers trying to one up the Marvel. Then here comes the X-Men announcement with the apocalypse. And then, uh, you got the Spider-Man trailer. And uh, kind of hoping Godzilla is going to trump them all. Uh, so, and uh, one final thanks. I just want to give a thanks to uh, Damian Bravo over at G Universe, uh, Joshua Hopkins, as well as Goji Fan 1993. All three of them took an opportunity and took time out of their schedule to um, remind people of this channel uh, to let people know that I'm up and running. And I appreciate that. I appreciate that kind of. Uh, uh, plugging and also I want to thank you guys the subscribers uh, especially the ones who actually sought me out uh, some people I weren't wasn't able to contact out of the 200 people that are subscribed I think I actually emailed about 40 people um, the rest is just people finding me and word of mouth so I just want to thank you guys for putting in the effort that means a lot to me because there's plenty of people doing what I do uh, I'm, I'm nothing special compared to other channels but um, if I'm doing something that you like, and if you like it enough that you sought me out to subscribe, then I will make sure that I continue to provide you with the content you like and try to entertain you the best way I can. So that's it to everybody. Uh, wonderful, wonderful night I hope you have. And a lot of good videos to come, so keep your eyes peeled. All right? Take it easy.